Okay, so this is basically like a follow-up to the August 3rd incident. I just discovered that uh, my Panasonic TV VCR combo, the heads are messed up. And what that means is like the picture is not coming out the way I want it to and it just doesn't look that great. So just to prove that the heads are not like fully functioning, I'm going to test two, uh, I'm going to put two VHS tapes in the VCR so you guys can see it for yourself. An officer and a gentleman and the great mouse detective. We're going to start with this one. Thirty-eighth week of nineteen ninety-four. The the VCR itself is not like entirely screwed up like my Toshiba one, but um, it's just got some heads issues. I'll see if I can fix it, but that might be an issue, a bit of an issue, considering this is a TV VCR combo, and I don't know how I'm gonna get into the VCR, but I'll figure something out. But yeah. Here's basically uh, what the screen looks like with the, the heads. Okay, I thought it was going to look a lot cleaner than that. Yeah, look at that. Paramount is pleased to bring you our feature presentation. <laughs> look at that! Perfect timing. Video heads may need cleaning warning screen. Yeah, I'm going to need to clean the heads on this VCR, as you can see. It's... You guys can't see it on uh, here, but there's a bunch of, like, tracking dots up there. Okay, you can see it now, actually. But, yeah. This will need to get cleaned at some point. Tape is fine for the most part, though. I'm pretty sure. And right, now here's the Great Mouse Detective. It's tough to get out. April 28th, 1992. Yeah, there you, there you can see it well enough. Yeah, every time I get, like, a, a heads issue, it gives me that message. So, yeah. This VCR will be just fine and, and, like, new, pretty much. It just needs good heads cleaning. And, again, I'm gonna have to figure out how to do that, although it may be quite difficult, considering this is a TV-VCR combo. <sighs> but, yeah. That's just unfortunate. And, uh, that stupid Raiders of the Lost Ark tape. Uh, unfortunately, is what caused this incident. Now, I did check the uh, the closing to that tape, and um, it has a similar closing to my VHS of Trading Places. It has, like, a black screen and then a white screen of death for a little bit, and then just goes to the black screen, and then that's the end of the tape, pretty much. But, yeah...